Hi, my name is Jake Barus. I'm 17 years old and a junior in high school. And whenever I was seven years old, I was diagnosed with a disorder called multiple hereditary exostosis, or bone tumors. It's a condition where bone-like tumors come from your bone and interfere with vital organ systems. They have studied my DNA, but so far no cure has been found. First thing they told us was there's good news and there's bad news. The good news was that none of the tumors were malignant. The bad news was they had seven more tumors in one x-ray that meant one side of the knee, of one, and only one knee. So they estimated at that time over 200 all over his body. Since then they have upped that to over 500. Were you afraid? I was very afraid. All I could see was that my child was going to be handicapped and that he wasn't going to lead a normal life. But Jake has made it so that he leads a normal life. He's more determined than I ever would have been. I didn't understand fully my condition or what the doctors were saying. I didn't even know what a tumor was. But a couple of months later, the pain started to get worse and my movements became even more limited. And that's when I started to worry that I wasn't going to be the same as others, that I was going to be weaker. And I started to feel sorry for myself. I uh, started to complain until uh, a friend of ours told us about a Shriners Hospital in Shreveport. And we went there, and uh, the kids there, I saw kids that couldn't walk, couldn't write, couldn't even move their heads. And I thought to myself, how could I complain? How could I be worried whenever these kids can't even move? And from that point on, I started to look at my condition as a blessing because it could be a whole lot worse. We came up with several ways to deal with the pain. One way is to use a rice sock, which is basically a sock with rice in it. You would heat it up and it would stay warm for about an hour, relaxing your muscles. We also uh, gave up my pain for those who need a miracle more than I did. Uh, I prayed for them for a while and uh, it would take my mind off the pain. It was the little things like that that helped me the most. You know, I didn't really need any major painkillers or anything like that. I found that the small things work better. We don't just have pain to punish us or it's not just supposed to tell us that something's wrong with our body. I believe that pain is one of the most effective ways of learning and growing in life. You know, you burn your hand on the stove and you know never to touch the stove again. With my tumors, I've learned more about morality and respect than I would have without them because I've had to work harder to achieve the things that I have today.